What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of iFishLI and back to another monthly unboxing for our Mystery Tackle Box. So if you guys don't know, I'm affiliated with Mystery Tackle Box. Um, I do these boxings, unboxings every month and I show you guys what's in the inshore box for the month and tell you guys what I think about it. So this here is the um, box for August inshore and it's the pro box. So I'm gonna get it right open and start out and tell you guys what I think. All right, so just got the card, what's inside. Start out with the cheapest item, work our way up to the most expensive item. First, these flu cooks, uh, the 218 Eagle Claw Laser Sharp Kale Offset Hooks. They're just fluke hooks. Um, good to have. I've got so many hooks now from these boxes. And I don't ever need to really buy them. Uh, up next, 399 Castaic Flutter Magic Spoon. This is going right in my Albi box slash tin box. Um, I, I've just been really getting really organized with all my tackle. If you guys want to see a video of how I've organized all my plugs, tins bucktails do a video on that drop a comment but this going right in my albi bonita box probably cast this pretty far um it's just your basic spoon so um sure i could catch some stuff on it good to have in the box after that 450 irons bait thumper what is it? this almost perfect spearing like the size of the spearing right now this is like how big they are so and sometimes they won't hit you know how the silver sides are like see-through almost white isn't the perfect color for them so this is perfect i've been on some bass and blues that are, are on spearing and they won't hit white they'll only hit like a translucent type color this is 450, three and a half inches. It's the perfect size for the spearing right now. So I think I'm actually gonna use this tonight at a spot that I've been hitting some schoolies that are on some spearing. Hopefully it puts in some work for me. And also, just a comment, for spearing, I don't love the paddle tail. I prefer a, um, a straight tail or like a fork tail, but the paddle tail will still do do a trick. And sometimes all they want is the paddle tail, sometimes all they want is the straight tail. I just find that straight tail works better when they're on spearing. Um, Lighthouse Lures Pro Mano 3, 699. That's this guy right here. This also, I know spearing don't have stripes like that, but it's not white, it's more flashy. I think that I could actually use this tonight as well. So maybe I'll uh, film night with these lures that I'm getting that I think could work well on my on my spearing bite and um this looks pretty good nice little jerk bait just real real twitch pause twitch pause maybe I could get a bite on this we'll see um 9.99 strike pro water striker it's a little spook I was getting earlier at the end of july i was getting some fish on spooks something looks looks exactly like this so I'll post on my instagram if i go back to that spot and try and get some bass on or blues on uh spooks and top water i well, basically looked exactly like this it's like not the traditional like circular fully circular spook i think in freshwater they call it a sammy so that's what this kind of looks like. They have a nice walking action. Last up, Guggen Squad Revolver, $12.99. So this is basically just a, uh, their rendition on the, um, on the Whopper Popper. Instead of it being at the back, it's right in the middle. Um, definitely like to test this out, see how much sound it makes. I'm gonna throw it in my plug box. Um, I'll bring it with me to uh, some daytime fishing for stripers. Yeah, so that is $12.99. That is all for in the box. They give a little 
just some different cards re to read about some of the stuff you get. Um, so also, I, that's it for the box. Always, like I say, always great to add new stuff to your tackle box. I love getting the soft plastics. I've recently used a bunch of the soft plastics um, when I'm trying to target spearing. I always get a, a lot of great stuff that imitates spearing, like the uh, Aaron's Bates Thumper. So, always, always great stuff coming out of these boxes. So that is it for the Mystery Tackle Box. I'm just gonna talk about some other stuff. Just do a little announcements. Uh, I wanted to just show you guys something I've been working on for a little while. Um, I actually started building rods recently. I built this um, inshore seven foot setup. Uh, came out really, really good up until I had to put the epoxy on, but it still looks, still, a nice rod it's pretty flexible and I got it paired with um, this little stratic so schoolie slayer maybe I could mess around and get an alpi on it this year some small blue fish should be a fun setup to use um, can't wait to try it out right now it's got some light mono on it I'm gonna switch it out for like 15 pound braid uh, and gonna start getting working on another rod soon don't know what i'm gonna build i don't really need anything right now i don't need more rods so maybe i'll just build another seven foot and gift it to a friend or give it away to one of you guys but also going back to rhode island in two weeks i'm so excited the fishing there is turning on the storm uh, kick started the uh the fall run so i think i'm gonna be getting into some really good action right when i show up got my car up there now I think I'm going to be able to pump out some really good videos and catch some really nice fish. So, I'm all ready, I'm all organized, and can't wait to get out there. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys are new to the channel, please make sure to subscribe. And I don't know why I didn't mention this at the beginning of the video, but if you guys want your own box for as low as $5, um, link in the bio, use code IFISHLI. Your first box, low as $5. Check it out. You get stuff like this. You get your largemouth bass box, panfish, trout, whatever you want. I code iFish LI, link in by. I link in the description, sorry. All right, see you guys in the next video.